Hey Aries, Jan Speaks here, and in this video, I am doing your mid-April 2019 monthly reading. So I have to start off by saying that all of these readings are general, so they may or may not resonate with you. So if you find that this reading does not resonate with you, then you're going to want to go ahead and book a private reading with me. All the information to do that will be in the description below. So let's get started. What is the important message that Aries need to hear this month. Y'all give me one second. I'm going to tell this little kid to turn this music down. <sighs> okay, guys, I'm sorry about that. So let's get into it. What important message do the Aries need to hear? What important message do they need to hear? Wow, it's funny because I pulled this for Taurus as well. Hmm, okay. So the important message that you need to hear this month is the 10 of Chalice's reverse. So I feel like um, a lot of you are very unhappy. A lot of you don't feel emotionally fulfilled by the person that you've been dealing with romantically. Um... I'm also getting from your spirit guys, they're saying like if you continue to stay in this situation, it will lead to you feeling emotionally unfulfilled. Okay, so that's crazy. I just pulled that for Taurus. Okay. What other important message do Aries need to hear? All right, so another, uh, well, some more important messages you need to hear this month is that, yeah, like I said, if you stay in this situation, you're going to always feel emotionally unfulfilled by this person. With the devil, I feel like this this connection has a toxic nature, nature to it. Um, I feel like you may be staying in it because you guys have become codependent towards each other, almost like an addiction that you feel for one another. Um... I feel like this this situation with this person takes a lot of strength out of you. Um, I feel like it drains you a lot. I feel like at times you may feel like you have to hold back from this person. And I also feel like with the Ace of Wands, I feel especially with the Ace of Wands and the Devil, I feel like a part of your codependent uh, addiction nature with this relationship is related to sex. So you and this person may have like really, really good sex. And I feel like that might be what keeps y'all staying, okay? So, let's get into your overall energy. What is the overall energy this month for Aries? Yeah, you guys' is, uh, reading is very similar to Taurus. You guys may even be dealing with a Taurus, some of you. Okay, every card in the reverse. Hmm. Okay, so we're starting off with the overall energy as death reverse and the queen of Chalice is reverse. So right off the bat, what this tells me is that you guys are resisting this relationship coming to an end. You guys are resisting a new beginning. You guys are resisting a transformation that you need to go through to become a better you, okay? And I feel like the reason why you're resisting it is because you're taking on the Queen of Chalice's reverse energy. So you guys aren't nurturing yourselves. You know, you guys are like kind of like an emotional wreck. You're very sad, probably crying all the time, um, not loving on yourself just being extremely emotional because you're just so unhappy but you're so unhappy but you you're just like refusing to end this okay but i feel like with the queen of pentacles reverse and the king of pentacles reverse i feel like you guys are dealing with someone who wasn't putting in the work to make this grow you guys were dealing with someone who may have financial issues um 
someone who's very materialistic, someone who is very greedy, all about themselves, someone who didn't really provide you any type of stability. You couldn't build with them. You couldn't grow with them, okay? And I feel like, you know, you're realizing that this situation will never grow to a higher commitment. It will never lead to marriage or success or happiness. And I feel like because you're realizing this, it has left you feeling unbalanced, okay? Um, a lot of you may be feeling really sad, um, you know, just off your, your rocker. Um, I feel like you guys are off-centered and, and very, like, unbalanced, like, emotionally. And I feel like you're off your rocker mentally, too, okay? So I just want to see, like more of your overall energy please show me more of the aries overall energy okay all right but here's the interesting thing though i feel like towards the month you're gonna come out of this space of being indecisive okay and i feel like the decision you're gonna make is to move on to walk away and you know if you look at this the sun, they don't really look too pleasant to have to walk away. Like, they don't look too happy about it. But it's like, you're realizing, I don't really want to walk away from this person, but I kind of have no choice, you know? It's, it's like, they, I, I, like, I really just have no choice. I feel like you guys stay in this situation because they, they like, fuck the shit out of you and they have like really good sex and that's what like keeps you here okay so what is how, how do they feel about the aries When we pull strength and we pulled this earlier okay so i feel like with the two of pentacles averse and the knight of wands averse they pretty much want to drop this connection um i feel like they are choosing to be unreliable they're choosing to not really commit to this situation um, there may be times where you feel like you can't always rely on them. You know what I mean? I feel like this person is immature. This person abuses their power. Um, this person, I just feel like they don't really care. Okay? And I feel like they may... It, recently, they may have taken a break from you. They may have isolated themselves from you. Because we do have the Hermit Reverse here. But I feel like with the Hermit Reverse, they're slowly coming out of that energy. So they've been, you know, not really dealing with you like that. It looks like they will communicate a little bit with you, but I don't feel like it's going to be much communication, and I don't feel like it's going to go anywhere, okay? Because I feel like they're still holding back from you. They're still practicing self-control, you know what I mean? Um, but they're not going to really give to the situation at all. Okay, we do have the higher frame reverse. So, yeah, like I said, this is not going to get to a higher commitment. And it's because, you know, their energy is the four pentacles. They're in self-protection mode. They're all about self. They're all about, you know, protecting themselves and their heart. And they just, they don't want to give to this anymore. The devil reverse. They want to release this. They feel like this is toxic. I feel like, honestly, what was keeping you staying was the sex. The hangman reverse. They may have feelings for someone new. We do have the ace of chalices in the upright. And we have the king of chalices in the upright. I feel like this is someone new that they're interested in. And I feel like with you, they're going to decide to release this. Because they just don't see it going anywhere. 
Okay, I like I said, I do see them coming because it's so fun. We have the higher form reverse and we have the hangman reverse right under each other. I do see them coming out of isolation and leaving you hanging. They're going to come out of that space and they're going to like have a talk with you. But I don't feel like it's going to be much conversation. It's just basically them saying, you know, I'm dropping this and, and that's what it is. And I feel like it's because they have someone new. They're offering a new cup of love to someone else that they are feeling emotionally fulfilled by. Um, I feel bad to say that, but that's what I'm seeing here. And it's funny that I'm actually, <laughs> I'm laughing because this sign is fun. Okay, the reason why I'm laughing is because not not because I'm trying to be funny with Aries. Not not at all. But put it like this. I know someone that personally that this re this reading resonates with so perfectly. Like as soon as I saw like this King of Chalices and this Ace of Chalices, I, it all came to me. I was like, oh shit. Like I know someone who's currently going through this. That's the Aries. So that's the only reason why I laugh. Not because I think like your pain is funny or anything like that. It's just, that's fucking crazy. Okay, I'm sorry. So I'm going to end this reading here. I hope you found it helpful. If you did, please go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button. And I'll talk to y'all soon. Bye.